everybody. So as you can see with my skin, I look pretty ravaged. <laughs> I had very deep microneedling done two days ago. And you can see really closely how red and splotchy and it looks pretty nasty right now, but I know the results will look amazing in a week. Um, and you guys know that I'm a big fan of the microneedling. Now I am getting ready uh, to uh, do an appearance and I did my eye makeup already, but I wanted to show you how amazing the Westmore Beauty CC Cream is for covering up damage like this. Um, especially because this has Arnica in it. So it is very healing and soothing for the skin. So I'm going to show you this. And then the shadow edit is another one that is just one of my favorite products to help when you're trying to conceal something like this. And you can see even like the, the difference between my skin and where I was microneedled. I mean, again, pretty ravaged. <laughs> it was no joke. Um, when you see the photos, you'll see that I, I was a bloody, bloody mess. So I'm going to take a little bit of the light CC cream and I'm going to mix it with a little bit of the medium CC cream because I like to add a little bit of depth and tone to my skin. And you'll be able to see how this really makes such a huge difference when you're trying to cover up something like that. So you can see I took a bunch of the, the medium and the light, just kind of mix it together like I would any good skincare regimen and just spread it over. So I'm gonna be very gentle because the skin is still open and raw, but you'll see how it's gonna give that coverage that I'm looking for. And because this is so deep, I may even need to layer it. I mean, it really was uh, pretty, uh, <laughs> I can't even think of the words. <laughs> it didn't hurt. That was the good thing. I was, I was pretty well numbed, but the after effect is always very scary. I, I terrify my family. But look at that. You can see how it instantly gave coverage and evened out all that skin tone. Now, I obviously did not get to my chest yet, but look at the difference now between the face and the neck. So I'm gonna go over and do a little bit on my neck and my, on my chest so you can see the coverage of that. And just a little bit. I really don't wanna go too heavy on it because I am still in the healing process, but it is good to be able to have an option of something that will give coverage. So I'm just gonna go to where my, my shirt's gonna cover, which is really just about here. And again, just being very gentle with the application process because I am still, still healing. But you can see just alone with the CC cream. Crazy, I mean, it's crazy good stuff. Now I'm gonna go over with my shadow edit and you'll see how that is just gonna help give even extra coverage. And this is packed with jojoba oil, all these wonderful natural soothing ingredients. And I really love to always apply this all over my face. I mean, it is made for the under eyes, but I apply it everywhere. Because when you have to go on camera, but you've had some massive, massive microneedling done, you don't want to look like it. <laughs> so there you have it. I'm going to finish up with my finishing powder and finish my eyes and that's it. I'll be done and ready for camera. But I just wanted to show you all the magic of the Westmore Beauty CC cream along with the magic of the shadow edit. Look at the difference in my skin. You wouldn't even know that I just had a bloody mess going on two days ago. I hope you all check these out. Lots of love.